Johnny. Long time no see. Wow, I can see that you are very green. Wearing a shirt that is a green product and drinking coffee from a recyclable cup. Of course, I believe that we should promote environmental sustainability and one way is to support companies that are green. I see. So, what are some of the green brands in Singapore? Well, let our fellow Singaporeans tell you the answer. Can you name one company that is green in Singapore? Uh, Shell. Come on. <laughs> Body Shop. Cold Storage. High Flux. Coca. Wow, there are so many green brands in Singapore. Do you know what are the initiatives they do? Of course, let me take you on a journey to all parts of the world. First and foremost, IKEA. It has its own Bring Your Own Bag campaign and sells reusable blue shopping bags. Proceeds from the sales goes to the Little Green Dot Student Research Grant that allows students to conduct research on methods of conserving marine life and fresh water. Also, a portion of which goes to the Worldwide Fund for Nature that promotes sustainable forest management. It also has its IKEA exchange event where it collected a total of 829 incandescent light bulbs in exchange for sparsome low energy bulbs. H&M, a leading fashion company, adopts a clothing recycling initiative. This allows customers to drop off bags of unloved clothing in selected stores in exchange for a $10 voucher. These clothes are then donated, recycled as fibers, or reused. We also have Body Shop, whose products are made from mostly 100% vegetarian products, uses sustainable palm oil, does not support animal testing, and uses recycled plastics which prevents millions of new plastic bottles having to be made every year. In the automotive industries, Toyota built cars with better fuel efficiency, from plug-in hybrids to fuel cell vehicles. It also does vehicle recycling by collecting discarded bumpers from dealers, recycling of plastics, and reusing of used parts. Wow, that's pretty amazing how much companies are doing to save the earth. Yup, that's why it's time for us, as individuals, to do something about the environment. Anyway, did you notice something in common between these companies? No, Johnny. Why? Most initiatives often involve interaction with consumers heavily. That is why their initiative resonates deeply in the consumer's mind. Companies such as Coca-Cola are often perceived otherwise. Hey, wait a minute. Do you just say Coca-Cola? I don't blame you for thinking that way as companies like Coca-Cola do not involve consumers' participation heavily in their programs. Even some Singaporeans feel the same way too. Well, I think like Coca-Cola uh, is a company they don't really care about the consumer's well-being. So I don't think they'll care about the environment as well. Because I didn't hear anything about them using environmentally friendly um, raw materials. Probably because they use a lot of chemicals. Ah, guess I'm just part of them. Well, let's hear what the CEO of Coca-Cola have to say. Mr. Coca. We have successfully placed 1 million coolers around the world with technology free of HFC, yet you hear correctly, 1 million coolers. This is a very important milestone in our sustainable journey, years of research and investment. We have also developed a fully recyclable PET plastic bottle using plant-based ingredients. It is partially made from up to 30% renewable plant material. Also, we have been working with Port using the technology to produce a new material for the interior of cars. Wow, I did not know that Coca-Cola is so green. Yup, but that's not all. Coca-Cola works with partners such as WWF and the United Nations Development Program to pilot sustainable farming projects worldwide, and it has contributed to more than 40 agriculture sustainability initiatives in more than 25 countries. These projects increase crop use and reduce production costs, helping farmers to improve agricultural practices and reduce environmental impacts. Besides partnering other organizations, Coca-Cola conducts its own water stewardship program by implementing a locally relevant water resource sustainability program detailing specific risk mitigation actions that help to preserve the sustainability of local water resources by the end of 2012. In 2011, 
582 had completed source water protection plan. Hey, let me add on to that. Maybe Coke can reduce these negative perceptions by having bowls in universities where free Coke will be given out with clean initiatives printed on their labels or having can recycling competition where participants will design a mascot using the cans. Yup, that's right. Speaking of that makes me want to drink Coke. How about a green date? Okay, let's go! Successfully place one million coolers around the world, <laughs> Shanice! <laughs> she will my breathing over there! Hey Sonia, so after all that has been discussed, let us look! <laughs> okay, go.